so it's been um it's been a couple days got the um the uh the paint's completely dry i went over it uh front and back with the uh with the scotch bright just a just a light uh sanding with the scotch bright just to kind of remove any any bumps or dimples or anything that uh, might have been in the paint and uh, it's pretty smooth I didn't want to do it enough that it would scratch or, or show like sand lines or anything uh, just enough to remove any debris that might have settled over any dust or any specks or anything I also uh, I did the neck uh, so the neck I actually sprayed the neck the neck turned out pretty nice um, it's a close-up of the neck here let's see so I think I think I'm gonna add some more to the neck. I think I'm gonna add some silver in it. Uh, but I, I kind of like the I kind of like the results, with the way the neck turned out. Um, I'm gonna add a little more silver to it, and then uh, it'll kind of give it layers. So we'll, we'll finish that up, and then uh, once that sets for a day or two, we'll uh, we'll go ahead and start our our finish coat on it with the uh, with the varathane. Uh, the ultimate polyurethane finish. So um, we're going to go ahead and take this outside. It's a nice day out. The sun. We had a couple of days of we had a couple of days of rain. So uh, it's nice and sunny out. It's actually nice. It's actually kind of nice and warm out there. So uh, I think today what we'll do is we'll we'll take it outside and uh, I'll go ahead and spray the overcoat of the purple over the base of the guitar and. Uh, We'll see how that turns out and we'll go from there. Um, hopefully we won't have to do anything else. We'll, uh, we'll let that sit for a few days. Maybe I'll have to add some color just to give it a little bit more depth. But um, I think it's gonna look pretty good. And then uh, once, that's, uh, once that's done, uh, we'll let it sit for a day or two. We'll hang it and we'll just let it dry for a day or two. And then we'll start, our, uh, we'll start building up our polyurethane. So I'm not going to sand any more on it. Uh, I don't want to add any scratches or any sand lines or anything to it. I want to get a I want to get a good base coat of poly on it, and then once I get a, a, a nice smooth base coat of polyurethane on there, then uh, we'll start the sanding process where we we sand it down and then uh, polish it out. But uh, there'll probably be a couple more videos. So I you know this is a short one. We're going to go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and move everything outside. I'll set it up and then uh, I'll show you how I coat the uh, coat the base of the guitar. Okay. Thanks for watching.